Grace be unto you, and peace from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ. I was glad when they said to me, let us go into the house of the Lord. I'm Father Steve Sellers, and thank you so much for tuning in today for this brief daily message of hope. Well, it's Saturday morning, and as uh, we uh, do most Saturday mornings, this is uh, confession time uh, in the church, and I've just uh, spent a couple of hours hearing confessions. Uh, and uh, a couple of things are going through my mind today. Uh, first up uh, is I'm always uh, struck by the fact that people uh, struggle so hard uh, to overcome uh, sin and temptation in their lives. Uh, and they uh, forget that, that the Lord is with them to help them overcome uh, temptation and to fight against sin. We're not in this battle all by ourselves. We often think that we do, but we're not. The Lord is with us. The one who brought us here continues with us. And then a couple of passages, for, passages from Scripture keep going through my mind today. Um, from 1 John, we uh, hear the words, um, If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. But if we confess our sins, God, who is faithful and just, will forgive our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Uh, God has given us his promise of mercy, uh, and it's available to us for asking. Often we get so proud uh, and we forget to ask for mercy, or we think that we're unlovable. What we've done has made us uh, far beyond the reach of God's love, and there could be nothing further from the truth than that. We're not unlovable. The Lord created us out of his love for us. And he loves us with his heart. And then the other verse that's gone through my mind is Jesus said this, uh, not everyone who calls upon me saying, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only those who do the will of my Father who is in heaven. It's important that we call out uh, to him for help, but we must be willing to do what he calls us to do. Uh, because if we don't, we're not living into the promises that he has for us. So what is it we're supposed to do? We're to love each other. Love one another as I have loved you. Uh, Jesus was very clear at that. As he has loved us with his whole heart, we are to love one another. Not to be angry, not to get even, not to carry grudges, not to be mean, not to be cruel, not to gossip about, none of that. We're to love one another. It's as simple and as profound and as difficult as that because we can't do that by ourselves. And yes, it's the one who is with us, our Lord himself, who helps us when we can do that. I hope you have a blessed rest of the day Saturday today. And God willing, uh, I will see you at Mass tomorrow and right back here on this broadcast uh, with my puppy Dot <laughs> on Monday. Have a blessed day.